Right. Right. He goes to me, shaking. My hands, so that his hand um, slides off. It didn't slide off. He's opened his eyes. He's attempted to breathe. All he needs is time. That's all we've asked for. The brain is a, it's a very complex thing, you know. It's it's yeah, eight weeks just to a broken leg. This is a brain. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've got a couple of things I want to ask you that's a, that's a little bit based on my own personal experience, which I want to stress, particularly for Derek's family who might be watching, is I know very different from yours in the sense that mercifully for me i've not had to have the conversations with doctors about discussions of turning off life support machines and derek's brainstem has never been affected in the way that four arches have but i have had to have conversations in my own head with myself sometimes when derek was in the coma in the state of minimum consciousness about how much my sort of i'm using this about myself not you but how much my frenzy to fight for him and to check every possible option was about me and my needs and how much was about him and I, I, I understand your fight but I guess what the courts are there for is to try and manage our instinct and also the right thing for the person as well aren't they have you thought about that Yes, of course I have, and if Archie was, if Archie was in pain and deteriorating the way that it's been put over to the courts, then I would be feeling very different, but it's not the case, and based on that not being the case, I find it very hard not to exhaust every option. Now, if there was no progression signs and he was going backwards or there was no improvement whatsoever, I would have no choice but to think different but he's not and whilst he is progressing it's very very hard to to stop fighting for his life i feel every day he's giving me different indications to continue to keep fighting it's not just myself it's archie's siblings it's archie's dad um, it's it's family and friends around us it's not just myself yeah. and you want time you, know, you want time Holly, you've been, That's all we've asked. you and your husband have been clinging super tight to hope uh, since April and today is the day that you discover whether that hope will be justified a little bit longer. Uh, all the legal opinion is that this, this appeal to the Supreme Court won't be successful, you know that, the lawyers will have told you that. Um, how, will you, how will you manage at 12 o'clock today if, if the decision goes against you? I don't know, I think it's very hard for anyone, obviously, to say or to see the future, how are you going to manage? Um, I don't know, I'd be lying if I You're right in the hospital know. now, aren't you? Will you, will you stay yes. there with him? Um, yes, we've, we've actually, we've, we've asked with regards to um, moving Archie, we wouldn't want Archie's final moments no. at this hospital. You know, is it Archie's brother can't even come and cuddle and have a conversation with his brother. It's, it's continuous people in and out of Archie's room. The doors open constantly. The curtains are open constantly. There's no privacy. It's, no. We will want one of Archie's last moments here. Well, Holly, whatever happens today, I can't tell you how much we send you our love and our prayers. And I think we speak for all our viewers. They, they send you all their love. And thank as you. I say, prayers. Thank you. Thank you Absolutely. for being uh, So much love and uh, huge bravery, huge bravery, whichever way it falls for you. Thank you, Holly. Thank you for giving us your time. Thank you. It's Holly Dance speaking to us very bravely just a short time ago. Well, in a, a statement last night, Bart's Health NHS Trust said this Our heartfelt sympathies and condolences remain with Archer's family at this difficult time. We're following the direction of the courts. So no changes will be made to Archer's care while the family appeal to the Supreme Court. Although we will prepare to withdraw treatment after midday today, unless directed otherwise. Do let us know your thoughts and feelings about this as well, because it's so complex, isn't it? Mm. Lots more still to come on Good Morning Britain.